county commissioners have started reviewing the proposed budget. We ask County Manager Dudley Watts to explain what this year's driving factors are. My, our budget and management director, Kyle Wolf, always likes to always say it's really about schools, debt, and people. And so if you look over the years at what, we're, what, what are the biggest areas that drive the overall budget, um, schools is al almost always the number one, um, you know, the number one. And so in this budget, uh, the schools are set to receive $7.2 million of new money. And so it's gonna increase their, their, the, that part of this budget to $168 million. And so it's a substantial amount of money. Uh, the next biggest driver in this budget is social services, which is a little bit unusual, but we are, we're going into Medicaid expansion. And so that's where we're locally administered, state supervised health and human services, and we've got a responsibility for social services. So $2.2 million of new money into the schools, their budget is $23 million. And so that tells you, you know, the scale from the schools to social services, and then debt. Debt's a big part of this budget. Um, we just issued um, uh, the, the last uh, issuance of the 2016 bonds, and so our authorization to issue debt we've, we've taken care of, but, but debt goes up in this budget, and it is the third highest increase, about a million four hundred thousand dollars and our total debt is about 70, if you just look at the net county part of that, it's kind of complicated, but it's about $76 million. And so, um, and then across the rest of the departments, obviously uh, the cost of, 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 of staff to deliver services drives really kind of everything else. <laughs>